today on Bible Bits and Mini Clips. Have you found your purpose? Your special purpose? Yeah, you have one. God put you here for a reason. Do you know what it is? Well, let's listen to uh, our friend Alistair Beek. And he will tell us that there's three headings that our life falls under. Verses 1 to 8. Ecclesiastes I'd like you to notice 3. that what we have described for us here is what we might refer to as the same old routine. Same old routine, followed by a whole new perspective. Verse 10, this is good news. I have seen the burden God has laid on men. In other words, the frustration that men and women experience is actually the result of a God-given burden. A God-given burden. God has created us for a purpose. And unless we discover and fulfill that divine purpose, we will never be fully satisfied with anything else that is offered along the journey of life and within the realm of Vanity Fair. And this, says the pundit, is the burden that God has laid on men, having made us for his pleasure, having created us in his image. We have to be forever dissatisfied until we come to know him, and until we come to live in fellowship with him. What the Bible says is that you and I, who live out the life that is ours, were actually made for his presence. Therefore, it is no surprise that our lives would be marked by frustration and by confusion when we turn away from him. It shouldn't surprise us that if we choose to live in the dark, we can't see. It shouldn't surprise us at all. And so if you haven't found your purpose, you'll be always restless trying to find it. Without God, you won't have much success. Well, please leave your comments below. Thank you for joining us. Tell a friend, hit subscribe, join us daily.